galaxy, Andromeda, is currently hurtling towards us at an unprecedented speed, its trajectory potentially set for a head-on collision with our very own Milky Way. The question is, will our galaxies actually collide, and if they do, what will happen to us on Earth? Should we be getting ready for an astronomical showdown because it's unlike anything the universe has ever seen? Around 10 billion years ago, the Milky Way had a cosmic encounter that forever changed its appearance. It collided with Gaia Enceladus, a tiny dwarf galaxy slightly smaller than our own. This momentous collision left an indelible mark on our universe as it flung stars outward to form the halo, generating a bar-like structure still present today. It was a pivotal moment that transformed the Milky Way into the galaxy we know today. But the Milky Way's galactic adventures didn't end there. It continues to be impacted by other galaxies, including the nearby elliptical Sagittarius galaxy. Its gravitational pull has induced waves of star formation and caused a warp in the galaxy's disk. These effects have contributed to the Milky Way's ongoing evolution, shaping its appearance and behavior. However, the most significant collision the Milky Way is poised to face is the impending encounter with the Large Magellanic Cloud, or LMC. This massive object, about one-tenth the size of the Milky Way, is set to collide with our galaxy in roughly two billion years. The resulting impact will be nothing short of cataclysmic and will most likely disrupt the Milky Way's inner halo and stellar disk. The collision with the LMC will significantly impact the Milky Way's black hole. Its size is projected to increase by up to eight times, which is a mind-boggling thought. This increase will likely have far-reaching consequences on the Milky Way's overall structure and behavior. It could make it more similar to other spiral galaxies that have undergone multiple significant mergers. Experts predict that the Andromeda and Milky Way galaxies will engage in a colossal collision in approximately 3 billion years, altering the fate of both galaxies. This long-awaited event will result in the creation of a new, singular, spheroidal, elliptical galaxy. However, don't get too excited just yet, as the probability of such a cosmic crash remains low due to the scarcity of stars in these galaxies. But what can we expect if this epic collision does indeed take place? Well, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. The merging process will come at a high price, as most of the star-forming gas in both galaxies will be consumed. This means that new star formation will come to a screeching halt, and the galaxy's bright blue color will fade into a more somber red hue. Additionally, the supermassive black holes at the heart of each galaxy will merge into one colossal black hole that will dominate the newly formed galaxy's center. This beast of a black hole will have a mass of over 100 million times that of our Sun and will significantly impact the galaxy's evolution. But wait, there's more. The collision will profoundly transform the galaxy's structure, properties, and star's ultimate destiny. As the galaxies merge, their stars will be flung out into new orbits and some will be cast out of the new galaxy altogether. The stars that remain will form new constellations and over time they will settle into a stable configuration. This enigmatic galaxy holds numerous secrets that are yet to be uncovered. The Andromeda galaxy has long perplexed astronomers, even the esteemed Hubble and the renowned 10th century Persian scientist Abid al-Rahman al-Sufi, who first mistook it for a nebulous smear. Its mysteries have continued to evade comprehension, with strange metaphors such as a candle shining through a horn used to describe its peculiar glow. William Herschel, a British observer in the late 18th century, deduced that Andromeda was a relatively small galaxy composed of gas and dust that a few bright stars could only illuminate. However, he was soon proven wrong, as astronomers like Harlow Shapley clashed with the belief that the Milky Way was the universe's sole entity and the only galaxy in existence. It was not until Edwin Hubble's breakthrough in 1925, with the most advanced telescope of that era, that the truth was revealed and the Andromeda galaxy secrets began to unfold. When Edwin Hubble discovered Cepheid variable stars in the Andromeda galaxy, he calculated its distance to be almost a million light years away. However, it later turned out that even Hubble had been deceived by Andromeda's tricks. What he didn't know at the time was that Cepheids were different types of stars. So, the distance between us and the galaxy was nearly three times greater at 2.5 million light years. 
Since then, Andromeda has continued to baffle us with numerous secrets, constantly undermining our understanding of galaxies. Its first detailed picture, taken in the late 19th century, revealed a spiral structure with large gaps between its arms, which helped astronomers understand that the Milky Way is not a solid stellar disk, but a similar spiral whirlpool. However, the shape of Andromeda posed a new puzzle in the 1970s when American astronomer Vera Rubin explored the galaxy. It was established that Andromeda's disk was 220 light-years in diameter times wider than the Milky Way. Rubin expected the stars at the edge of the disk to revolve slowly around the galactic nucleus, but instead they were speeding around it like race cars on a track. This paradox led Rubin to discover massive dark matter galactic halos, an invisible substance that kept the galaxy from falling apart. Although it remains unclear what dark matter is made of, Andromeda has helped scientists create realistic simulations of how galaxies move and develop. Still, another problem arose when simulations showed hundreds of dwarf satellite galaxies surrounding any large galaxy. The Andromeda galaxy continues to reveal its secrets, captivating astronomers and challenging our understanding of the universe. Only dozens of galaxies were previously known, but in 2022, Italian amateur astrophotographer Giuseppe Donatello discovered an ultra-faint galaxy named Pegasus 5. It's located close to Andromeda's disk and is difficult to observe due to the age of its stars, which formed around 12.5 billion years ago. Typically, dwarf galaxies don't survive long due to being consumed by larger neighbors. Andromeda's companion is considered a priceless artifact from the early universe, but the discovery of Pegasus 5 suggests that more dwarf galaxies may be hiding in plain sight. The Hubble Space Telescope captured an image of the Milky Way's nucleus, which is home to the supermassive black hole Sagittarius A star, weighing more than 4 billion suns and influencing all nearby stars. In 2022, researchers spotted something unique in one of Andromeda's globular clusters, a black hole weighing 100,000 suns, evidenced by the star's orbits around it. This finding suggests that these elusive objects may be hiding in other clusters, including those beyond Andromeda. Surprisingly, even the heaviest black holes have modest sizes comparable to gas giants like Jupiter. One of the biggest mysteries surrounding Andromeda is the absence of any exoplanets. While over 5,000 exoplanets have been discovered within the Milky Way, none have been found in our neighboring galaxy. Despite the incredible detail the Hubble Space Telescope provides, it's simply too far away to observe exoplanets in action. However, in 1999, astronomers got lucky when one of Andromeda's stars passed in front of another. The second star was believed to have a gas giant more than six times heavier than Jupiter, which would make it the first exoplanet found outside the Milky Way. Unfortunately, this effect could also be the result of data distortion, and we may never have the chance to confirm it. But what if the lack of visible exoplanets in Andromeda isn't due to imperfections in our telescopes? What if there's a mysterious force that prevents exoplanets from appearing or even destroys them? While it may sound a little out there, the fact remains that trillions of stars in Andromeda have almost no exoplanets orbiting them. This is in stark contrast to the Milky Way, where exoplanets are relatively abundant. In 1885, Irish astronomer Isaac Ward observed a supernova explosion near Andromeda's nucleus, indicating that there must be enough material for exoplanets. However, this remains the only supernova humans have spotted in Andromeda, whereas there are dozens in the Milky Way. Could our neighbor be hiding something from us? The James Webb Space Telescope has the potential to unravel the mystery of the Andromeda galaxy's planetary absence, which has long puzzled astronomers. With its advanced capabilities, the telescope can detect distant exoplanets, allowing us to determine whether there are any in Andromeda. Alternatively, we may have to wait until the eventual collision of Andromeda with the Milky Way, which would create a spectacular light show that would last for billions of years. However, this event may also obstruct our ability to study the rest of the universe. During this period, civilizations that start their space exploration may assume that the Milky Way and Andromeda are the only galaxies in existence, hindering our understanding of the cosmos. Andromeda will continue to fascinate us for years to come as it remains a tempting target for scientific exploration.
Its mysteries will gradually unravel as technology advances, and the James Webb Space Telescope may help provide some answers. Ultimately, only time will tell what secrets Andromeda holds, but it will captivate us for a long time. If you don't want to miss our upcoming videos, click the subscribe button and the bell icon to activate notifications.